today's review don't forget if you are new to my channel go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified anytime i upload new content also i recently started my own beauty brand i am plugging this in every video right now we are featuring 100 percent real make lashes right now i am wearing the style candy red they are 25 millimeter lashes 3d Go ahead and click the link in the description box to make your purchase. Okay, guys. So today's unit, I'm in love with it. After I did some modifications, you know what? Your girl had to do her modifications always just to make the cut the unit look like a custom unit. Um, today's unit is by Sensational or Sensational, Sensational, however you want to call it. Um, it is part of their butter lace line. It is a human hair and premium fiber blend, which I am always for. I, I, love, I love that premium blend because it makes the hair look and feel more authentic, more real. The, the style is straight 32, so she's a straight 32 inch unit, and she's in the color Balayage Caramel. Um, I'm with, I don't know if I would call this 32 inches though. Like, hold on, let me move this out of the way. So let me back it up. So. 
I'm 5'2". And the unit comes down to my butt. I've never had 32 inch hair. So I can't sit here and say it's 32 inches or not. I'm taking the much of the tape out to like check. But this is a long ass unit, whether it's 30, 32, 34 inches. This is really long, especially for somebody my height. Um, so I can appreciate it. It did what it came to do, you know? Um, let me see. The specs on this is that it does have HD lace. And yes, it does. I did. I was able to flawlessly lay the lace. I did customize the hairline to match my own. Um, if, when I was doing my hair on the camera, you probably could see some lace lifting up here. That's just because I don't use glue. I could have glued this unit down, which I'm killing myself. I really should have. But it's cool, whatever, because I got another review to do anyway soon. But this is a unit that you could wear for a good solid like week, 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 two weeks before it starts looking bad. Um, and that's because of the customizations I did. When I first got this unit, she was thicker than this. I thinned her out because as soon as I took her out of the pack, I could tell that she was going to tangle. Number one, the length, the texture is um, silky, but like not fake silky but it's more like um pressed natural hair silky so it does resem resemble uh real hair however it being so long and so thick it was bound to tangle so i took some of the thickness out just to prevent the tangling as much as i can it's still gonna tangle but it's gonna tangle a lot less and i'm able to run my fingers through the hair flawlessly so that's one of the, that's the second modification I did besides the um, customizing the hairline. Um, besides customizing the hairline to match mine, to mimic my own, I went ahead and did go back in and did some extra plucking to the hairline. That's just me. You did not have to pluck it at all. Um, that I'm just, I'm just really peculiar about how the hairline looks. It has to look 100% natural. And for me, some, sometimes the hairlines are a little bit too dense to look as natural. Uh, or the way the knots are put in, it's too uniform. It's too much like a circle. Um, some of the features, another feature, it says full body movement. Of course, yeah, obviously 32 inches going to be some movement going on. The lace. It says blends with most skin tones. I will say that it did not come no gray color. When Sensational first started coming out with a wet lace line, that lace was gray. I don't know who they was trying to make that lace for, but it wasn't for nobody live. White, black, Chinese, whoever. But now the lace was a light brown. So if you are a lighter skin sister, um, you good. You good. You don't have to tint the lace. I did tint the lace. I used my Ebon lace tint. And I don't think I had to go back over it with any foundation. Um, so that was a good match for me. Um, where is it? This is the dark brown skin tone. That's a good match for me to blend the lace. I always get darker than... I, I go with my contour shade and um, to match my hair. Because if I don't want to wear makeup, I don't want it to be too light on me. Or My perimeter of my face is darker than the center. So... I always go with my contour shade to match. It was ear to ear, however, for me, I have a low hairline. And so that's the reason why I customize the the hairline to match my own. Because in order to cover up the hairline on the sides, I have to pull it forward. Um, uh, and then with the way the hairline is on the wig before I customize, it'll look like down here. And I think it makes it obvious that there's a wig on your head when you only have this much hair of a forehead showing. It's better to just customize it to match your own forehead. I just laid some of the baby hairs on the side and it, yeah. Um, let's get into this color because I'm loving the way that these custom colors are being made by Alt. I think Alt, every every company, Altray, Sensational, um vanessa brands it's a wig etc etc they're going like 100 with the custom colors this um like i said i have balayage caramel on right now and it's really it's it's a uh, color 30 mixed with 27 and the highlights are 613 mixed with 27 and it gives this nice warm uh warm color that they have going on here 
This comes, of course, a bunch of other custom colors. Um, the Balayage Hazelnut, Mocha, Balayage Mocha, Balayage Gold, Balayage Chocolate. I'm really thinking about getting the Balayage Gold because that's really, that's like a number one with um, 27 highlights. That's going to be so pretty. Another thing about the color is it's not just on top anymore. If you split this way like that, the way how the 1B goes into the color, it's like that throughout the wig. So I'm really impressed by the way they're making these wigs now. The reason, one of the reasons why I stopped doing wig reviews the last time was because all the wigs was looking the same. And I was like, I just can't. Like, I'm not interested anymore. I don't really want to do this no more. And I was just like, you know what? It was all, it was, it was stressful with the wig, dealing with the wig companies. That's why I don't deal with them anymore. I'll pay for my wig and do my wig reviews. I don't mind. It was just a bunch of stuff that I, the reason why I quit. And the, like I said, the reason, one of the other, one of the main reasons was that the wig started looking the same and now they're and they're stepping their game up now and i'm really happy but let me go ahead and do a, a 360 for you guys so this is the front this is how long she is she is kind of layered so i do like that too this is her in the back and there you go so yeah, I really love this unit. Um, I, I know I love a unit when I think about what other colors I want to get her in. So yeah, this is a grab, and I'll put the I'll put the, where you can purchase her, a um, couple of websites in the description box down below. If you have any other questions, go ahead and type them in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye.